When we started with 5G, of course, we thought a lot about industries, as Cristiano said, I mean, secure, uh, many more connect connections, etc. That was the start of uh, the 5G, and suddenly you have new currencies. And I mean with the currency, low latency is a new currency, security is a new, uh, and uh, multi-connectivity is a new one. Speed and throughput will be there as well. So that's how 5G started, so one need to remember that. Ultimately, consumers will get the benefit of all that as well. But it's also a lot of use cases for industries and society. And when I think about what this industry the sort of the, the mobility broadband and cloud has done. We have started with the transformation of us in this room with a smartphone. That's where we are. Where we are now starting to do is also transform industries and ultimately the society. And that's what Cristiano talked about. So the 21st century's infrastructure to make it sustainable will be 4G enabled 5G where you can actually do so, everything for connected cars, uh, smart cities and all of that. That's the next step. Obviously, consumers, we in this room, we will get higher speeds, more throughput and all of that. But it's also geared for industries being transformed and society getting possibility to transform industry and be more efficient.